My name is Robin Held. I'm Chief Curator of the Fry Art Museum. And I'm really pleased today that we have with us uh, author and cultural critic Grill Marcus on the occasion of The Old Weird America, an, uh, an exhibition uh, coordinated by the Contemporary Art Museum Houston in its final incarnation at the Fry through the end of the year. So one of the key works in the show is uh, an installation called Main Drag by Margaret Kilgallen, who unfortunately died at a very young age uh, several years ago. And it's the first time a work, this work has been in the Northwest. Um, and the way Toby Camps, the curator of the exhibition, talks about this is the kind of changes going on in the Mission District in San Francisco. Um, neighborhoods changing and in some cases becoming more commodified to the extent that if you if you were in a beer store you would go and you would find a beer sign but still within that neighborhood that um, someone new opening a, a liquor store would put would have someone hand paint the sign and then even make it clearer by having a liquor bottle on it or, or a, a ham hock if it was a, a butcher store so a kind of amalgamation of maybe a small town America that never existed, the, the nostalgic roots we invent later. There are lots of ways to go. I don't know, th this doesn't have any nostalgia in it for me at all. I mean, this is still, this is still San Francisco. Mm -hmm. This is still uh, Folsom Street. Um, this is still Mission um, before it gets into the Mission District, Mission mm -hmm. Street, mm -hmm. just below um, Market Street. It's, it's got, uh, it captures um, the decay. It, it, this is Skid Row. This is the dead end. Um, over here, you, you see this, this building is, is beginning to rot. Um, this is a this is a bar where you go. You, you don't want to be seen. Uh, this is a bar where you go in uh, when it opens at eight or nine in the morning, and you stay there until it closes. Um, yeah. This is this is this is no fun, and um, it's ugly. But it, it, it you know with with the street the way it's angled here, it's like Seattle Skid Row. Um, the original skip room when they used to um, uh, uh, send the um, send the lumber right down the street, right down the hill to the, uh, to the ships. And I'd say one thing that contradicts, or maybe just adds a different texture to what you're saying, is it's daylight, and they aren't really decaying in this nasty, ugly, moldy. Uh, ruin. They don't. They don't look like ruins. There's almost a kind of I don't know, like La Boca kind of sense. I mean, there's a... I don't see it that way. Mm -hmm. I mean, there is a crumminess to this that she has captured perfectly. And, you know, walking down uh, those streets in San Francisco today, um, you, you have this overwhelming sense of not just people who've given up, but a whole part of the city that's uh, been left there for people who've given up. If you've given up, you can be at home. Uh, that's that's how I see this, uh, and I don't see any nostalgia because, like I said, it's, it still looks just like this.